Aloha Scorpio, this is Tanya from Saiba Yoga and I help you navigate your life. Today it's time for your May 2021 tarot reading. We're gonna start with the Golden Girls Tarot in a minute. And before that, I just wanna smoke some Palo Santo wood so that we can attract the spirits and cleanse the air. Now, spirit guides, would you please come here? and guide our beautiful Scorpio people towards their highest possible spiritual path, please. We welcome the answers we get through this deck and we would like the answers to come through as clear as possible, please. Thank you so much in advance. Scorpio May 2021, please. Scorpio May 2021, the magician, number one, very good. Scorpio May 2021. Three of Cups, also very good. What else do we get for love? Love for Scorpio, please. Love for Scorpio, please. Love for Scorpio, please. For love, we've got the Nine of Pentacles. What do we have for money and career? Money and career for Scorpio. The Five of Pentacles reversed. And can we get a clarifier for the Nine of Pentacles, please? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here, please? Thank you. Two of Wands. And why is the Five of Pentacles here? Temperance, okay, wonderful. We're done shuffling and we'll go right into your reading. So here is your reading. In general, you have the Magician and the Three of Cups. That's very good because the Magician is a major arcana. That is a card of you having all of the skills that you need in order to achieve what you want. And you are looking very skillful to people and very charismatic. So people are fascinated by what you do. They watch you and they go like, wow, how did you do that? Just like a Magician would. And you have everything you need. All the tools are on the table. So you're standing up at the beginning of a new journey in your general life in May and you will succeed with that because you're really skilled. Also with the Three of Cups, it's a 100% win for you. This is a victory. This is a time of celebration. If you work in a team, your team will accomplish something. You will celebrate. If you work alone, you are reaching some kind of goal. If you are studying, then you will pass a test. So this is definitely a reason to celebrate here for you in May. And then we have for love, the Nine of Pentacles with the Two of Wands. That's very, very good. Uh, the Nine of Pentacles is talking about you being very happy where you are because you have all these pentacles around you. You can see that this woman is really happy. So um, you have this, if you're single, you have the self-discipline and the self-reliance. You can um, be absolutely single on your own. You don't mind. You're absolutely happy with that. And if you are in a relationship, this would mean that you two are enjoying life's rich you are enjoying it doesn't matter if you're rich or poor I mean this in the sense of you're enjoying what you have so if you are rich you're probably gonna enjoy a five-star hotel and if you're poor you're just gonna enjoy sitting out in your garden and having a good coffee you know what I mean so you're just in the feeling of enjoying life and being really happy with what you got um, with the two of wands you're standing in front of a decision uh, you have two options here so either you have the option between two two people who come into your life and say hi i'd like to be in a relationship with you yeah for you singles out there and for you others out there you will have an option for example maybe someone is coming along and saying hey let's bring our relationship to the next level let's get, move together let's get married or something like this and you have to decide which way do you want to go do you want to stay in your old comfort zone or do you want to go see the world and have a new adventure and see how that goes so it's absolutely up to you you can decide um 
you, to leave your comfort zone and I would um, even if, if you're a little bit afraid of it I would give it a try because um, the things we're a little bit afraid of they they sometimes can teach us a lot yeah because if we jump into our fears then we can see oh maybe I was wrong it, it's not so horrible after all as I thought. So then for money, we have the five of pentacles reversed. This is really, really good. And I'm telling you why, because if it would have come out like this, this would have been a period of scarcity, but no, it came in the reverse. So that means after some form of struggle with your money, you will now regain your hope and you will go on a better way. You're on the way to recovery. So your financial situation will recover here. Maybe you get a new job, a new home. Something is definitely new here, especially because we've got the magician here. So also you have the temperance card right with it. With the temperance card, you can see she's tapping into, I don't know if you see this, she's tapping into water here with her feet. So she's tapping into the divine timing, into the divine flow. This person is trusting. So you're trusting your path. You, you know that God or whoever you believe in will bring you something. The universe will bring you something that will bring you back on track again. And you will feel this either a new job, a new home, but definitely you're getting back on track here with your money. So I think this is a very positive reading. Let me give you one more card from the angel deck. Let's see. What's in store here, please? Thank you for May 2021. Okay, we already got one. Oh, it's the new beginning. <laughs> that is the hanged man. The hanged man number 12 is talking about um, you maybe even in, in being in a period of waiting. So sometimes it's it means that you have to wait a little, that you need some more patience until something's coming. But also it can mean it's time to change your perspective, okay? This is why the dog is upside down, yeah? It's, it's time to have a different look at your situation. You have a huge talent and a skill we've, we've been talking talking about this with the magician that you have skills and right now you have wonderful opportunities this is a good time for you to visualize to manifest it's it's really time for the universe to give you what you need but you have to manifest this you <laughs> I can't speak anymore you have to manifest it you have to visualize it maybe you want to make a vision board or something like that don't worry if there is some stop uh, or, or a break in your momentum then um, this will just give you time to think about your plans because if there is a little stop in your or break in your momentum this is your time to think about which way should i go which decision should i make so don't worry if there is a pause yeah um, take your unique gifts and believe in yourself and believe in the universe that it will help you on your path. So I find this absolutely fantastic. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing. Thank you for already more than 2,200 subscribers. I feel really honored. And thank you for your energy compensations. I see you next time. Bye.